three times a week it's gonna be like this. Three times a week. Working early like this. Three times a week. <laughs> hmm? Yeah, tomorrow as well. Tomorrow I'm also gonna work this early, but tomorrow I'm gonna work longer. Unlike today where I have to stop earlier. Hey Prometheus, welcome. Good. Brisbane, boys, let's go. Oh, zurück, Black Crypt. <laughs> Auf jeden Fall. Das ist aber richtig lieb. Habibi. Das ist Kaffee übrigens. Kaffee. <laughs> Firing angles look pretty good. The super heal is a tiny bit better than the Mino here, which is nice. And Mino's heal is already good. Oh, Krümelmon, sie auch zurück. Richtiger Ehrenmann. <coughs> Unlike Mino, we have plane based anti submarine warfare. That is pretty nuts, actually. That That is like giga nuts. Wow, we have plane based anti submarine warfare. That is actually pretty strong. Holy moly. AJP, hey, welcome. Of course we have HG, we have half the DPM though only, we gotta remind ourselves about that part. Something doing here. I have no idea, boys. Better watch out here. Torpedoes to port. And we're safe. Torpedoes to port. Problem solved, sir. Torpedoes to port. Torpedoes are stern. <coughs> yeah, fighting against a submarine makes things a tiny bit harder. But it's still fine. Does it also have improved AP angles? I guess it has. Or not. Good. Somebody wanted to YOLO me. Very successful. <coughs> Why is he not going down? I have no idea. Don't ask me what, why the submarine player decided to do this. I'm not a wizard, my friend. Oh, that we're gonna get caught here soon, but it's fine. Okay, if the moin keeps going like this, this is actually very good for us. Then we can go away. Hey, we got our first fire and the instant damage gone that re. Problem 
I think I got the submarine. Yep. Beautiful submarine is gone. Submarine destroyed. Torpedoes to port. Submarine dog is gone. Who's spotting me? Who's spotting me? Oh, the Des Moines from the back. Ooh, that's a second kill. <coughs> Whew. Now let's finish off that the moin. I'll explain how you get the ship in a bit. Let me just try to finish off that the moin first. Somebody really hates OSV. Can't blame him, but I think we got him. He needs to hit one torp. Come on, bro. He can with hit one torp, right? Come on. Or one skip bomber. Oh man. Phew. This was actually a really good battle so far. <coughs> a lot of action, a lot of people trying to push me, a lot of people failing. <laughs> but so far the ship looks very solid, like what you would expect from a Minotaur class, kind of. Or not class, but the Minotaur hull. I had to launch early and you know why and they're probably gonna miss because this freaking battleship player thought it's a good idea to push there. If that conqueror didn't push there, I could have probably hit the torpedoes better. Do not fire at your allies. Okay, I gotta move now. Yeah, this is very risky. Come on, move, 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 move. I just wish the Conqueror didn't push there at the beginning, because then it could have been easier for me. I did. I had to launch them early, um, because he was pushing it, and otherwise I would have only hit him. I would say Trenna definitely had impact on this game. Yeah, first game was pretty good in it. I can't deny that. Very good to say even. <coughs> I do like that it has 12 cam torps um, and a 12 cam height. No, 13.5 cam torps actually. What am I saying? Like, those torps are actually amazing. Gotta watch out though here. This CV is gonna be very annoying for me. get the rune and then we're gonna go down but that's fine we destroyed an enemy cruiser Woo! lovely absolutely lovely <coughs> captain haddock moin uh, holy inquisitor uh, inquisitor why early stream today mrs trendless started working 
and to have more time with her or in general like making more sense in the working environment she's working three days a, uh, three days a week so i thought hey we can just go three days a week early then and the other days we're gonna go maybe as well early or as normal but I've, as, nothing is going to change that besides that you usually get a bit more streaming time the only thing today is I gotta to stop today early at like four ish because um, I'm gonna go into the f uh, theater with my mother and her. <clears throat> hey, Pencil Kicks! But man, Brisbane is a lot of fun. I mean, I did expect it from kind of a radar mino of HG. Sure, the, the DPM is only half as mino, and apparently you don't get the improved AP angles, but. Holy moly, that HG is really nice. The torps are fantastic. And something that people really underestimate with this ship, which is a huge advantage over minor, a huge, you get plain anti submarine warfare. 8km. That's amazing. That's that's such a plus side that we should not forget because Minotaur doesn't get it. Minotaur has direct and um, death charge drops, like they shoot up and land somewhere next to the ship. One of the crappiest one in the game, while well, this one gets plain anti-submarine warfare, which is a huge plus. Not a little one, a huge plus. So this is definitely already, I can tell, a very nice ship to play. It does have some disadvantages over Mino, but it has also some advantages. 12km high radar, yes, only half the duration, but 12km. Um, HE. AP not that great though, Mino excels there with double the DPM and better ricochet angles. It does have a better super heal than Mino, which came to my surprise. Um, it heals 200 HP per second more than Mino. And yeah, I mean, 10 torps. I think Mino has 8 per side. 13.5 km range, which is fantastic. And yeah, a bit worse to consume it, but overall, this seems to be a really fun ship. Now, how do you get the ship? I can tell you, my friends, uh, JP. I can tell you, and for all the others that are listening, it's a bit more complicated. So. We would like to give you uh, very little information on Web Adventure Brisbane. Coming up, that contains the Tier 10 ship Brisbane and the Commander Matilda Kelly. As you all have a lot of interaction with the community question, we want to be giving a very nice answer. The web campaign will begin on Friday, the March the 10th, Hello there. and will allow players to earn or buy event tokens. The top items are the Brisbane and the 19 point commander Matilda Kelly with a unique pirate voiceover. Tokens can be earned through combat missions by purchasing random bundles with doubloons and spending in game resources. One of the top items can be earned without expenditure of doubloons. However, it will still require expenditure of in-game resources, including credits, free XP, coal, community tokens and steel. I don't know if you need to spend all of them or one of them, it's not really particularly saying it, but technically you can get the Brisbane for free. To acquire Matilda Kelly and Brisbane, you will have to spend a bit of doubloons. Brisbane and here so you know it, Brisbane will be in the future available for coal as well. I guess after all this web campaign. So you know how to get it. But it's a really nice ship. I already I already love it. I mean, I love Minotaur. So it's not really hard to love like kind of a hole like this already. Confederate, devastating strike, 4 kills. 2.6 ba base XP, nearly 2.7. Let's try this again directly. Briefless, thank you for your follow. So technically you can get this ship for free. Although you have to spend some in-game resources. I don't know how many, so I can't tell you something there. Or you wait and the ship will be eventually available for coal. Which is kind of easy to get, honestly. 